That's right. So up here, you're right. Here you've got them in centimeters, but then down there. My dad was a teacher, so I, I grew up uh, with a teacher for a parent. I, I knew since I was a kid that being a teacher was not a lucrative uh, job. It wasn't something I was ever going to get rich doing. I, I came into it because I wanted to make a difference, make a real difference in people's lives. Three or four years into my career, I could see problems that we were having and I could even think of a few decent solutions and yet I had absolutely no power to enact any of those things. I had no power to actually make any change. There were always obstacles in the way of me trying to change things or improve things. I remember a lot of conversations with my wife where I just said, is this really what I should keep doing? I feel like I'm good at this and yet I don't know if I can continue to do this. So about two days before the school year started last year, uh, George Bowman came in and announced to our school, our staff, that our junior high school was going to be repurposed and become a new tech high school. My first reaction was just pure excitement. I, I thought, this is it. This is, uh, this is what I've been waiting for. This is what I... I went into education in college and this is what I wanted to be involved in. When George told us that every student would have a computer, that everything we did would be project-based, I just felt like that's exactly what we've been lacking. Compass Academy has been running for four months now. I've honestly never felt so energized about what I'm doing. It's really the first time in my career where I, I feel empowered to do the best job that I can do.